Hey everybody, um, I hope it's recording. It's me, Super Paul Games. I'm Paul. Hey, how are you doing? Get your comfy pants on. All my pants are comfy. That's awesome. Um, this game's going to take a little bit of an introduction. I'd like to introduce it to you. Maybe you'd like to go out. <laughs> um, for a while, some people have asked me to do strategy games, and though I like to play some by myself, in fact, I spent a lot of my childhood and teen years doing that by myself, and other things by myself you don't need to know about. So I thought I'd get one out. So, you know, why not make it doubly nerdy? It's a strategy game, and it's a Star Trek The Next Generation game. It's Star Trek The Next Generation Birth of the Federation, for all of those who, who can't read. And basically you take one of the five superpowers of the show, Continue and I'm sorry the game if- parameters. Ah, I'm scared, computer. I'm sorry if it lags a little bit. I'm still getting used to the settings. So, um, there's like five different tech. It's really cool. You can start the different empires and different, um, this is the technology levels, basically, or how developed they are. So, you know, if you want to be way more developed or way less developed, it's really cool. Um, we're going to have a bunch of minor races on here. We'll have a normal difficulty. We'll have random events on. That means, like, the Borg can show up. If that happens early in the game we will lose and this game is I'm not gonna load it up unless it crashes so whatever happens happens um, we're gonna turn this to medium usually I play large but it can bog things down and I don't think you guys want to sit here for 16 hours maybe you do I don't know select galactic power to control and so we can be one of these guys I don't know I know who I'm gonna be I love the Klingons but I'm going to be the United Federations of Planets. The United Federation. The Federation is a, oops, a free society and its people value liberty and equality. Their talents are better suited to research than to espionage. Their technology is often the envy of other societies. Their diplomats are very skilled in most minor races. Uh, I'll explain minor races quickly. Is um, You're in space, right? You're on a planet. Dirk to dirk, I'm on a planet. That's what I always say. And um, you have the major five um, sides like this and then you'll have like you'll go to a solar system and there'll be just like one group they'll be like the Vulcans and um, any of these five major guys the Fringis the Federation whatever can try and get the minor races to join them and since the Federation is made up mostly of that stuff um, minor races like us more our starships are well shielded and designed to function well alone as in groups the tech thing is bad though um, not the tech thing the espionage thing. The so, United Federation of Planets. That's us. Um, normally there would be a little intro video after this. If I can find it, I'll post it. I, it doesn't run for some reason on this. It's not a big deal. It's basically, we're the Federation. We're a bunch of friends. Be our friend. Arr. Paraphrasing slightly. Always remember that expansion is achieved by diplomacy, not by the military. Starfleet's mission is to preserve the peace. Our ships are not intended to start wars, but to end them. We attack only as a last resort. Everything got black. Okay, game loading. Here we are, we're in our solar system. Here's Earth. It's Earth and um, Mars and I don't remember them all. Saturn, right? Uranus, Uranus, Neptune, Pluto, Jupiter. Uh, well, there's Mercury. What's the other fucker? Venus? Mercury and penis. I think I got them right. Yay for me! Um, this is our home planet. You can see the systems. And um, if you hover over them, the little sun things means we get extra energy. Uh, the plant things is extra food. The crystal here means you have dilithium crystals. And you need those to build ships. For each dilithium crystal you have, you can work on one ship at a time. It takes turns to build ships. Um, as you can see, our population is not full up yet. It will be soon. So if we double click on this. Um, these are all the things we can build. Farms for foods. Replicators to build more shit. Plasma reactors for energy. We'll need that later on. Databanks. We need that for espionage and universities. 
so we're gonna build two data banks because we're gonna get raped on that soon and we're gonna start um or let's do a colony ship and what I'm gonna do is if we get our ass kicked we're done and so here's some other solar systems the yellow ring is for medium tra uh, ships some ships have will have a medium range um, See, this says long range. Long range can go out to the red, and then the, um, how do I unclick? And then the green are short range. And, whoa, I'm not used to a media map. It looks so tiny. This is our quadrant of our quadrant of the galaxy. The alpha quadrant. So we're going to send our science ship here to explore, and then we're just going to wait. Because this is our colony ship, and it it's, doesn't have any weapons. So, And we have 2,000 credits, so we're just going to hit the turn button. Turn! That was... One does not simply send their colony ship to Murdor. <laughs> so what I did is I'm telling my colony ship to go here. Because we want to colonize this shithole. Um, we're going to have our science ship go up here. Science ships... Science ships? Science ships can see around them. Because we want to see what this planet is. So... Turn! Once again, we'll move that here, and we're going to start colonizing. I want to live on a planet. Which one? So we'll pick terraform. Select planet for terraforming. How about a fun desert planet? That doesn't sound fun at all. Terraform it! And now we've started our colony ship. And we're going to buy it, because we have credits. Purchase ordered. Because I want to get that shit going, bitch horse. <laughs> Sorry. Um, we're gonna get a troop transport. Troop transports you can use to land troops on planets to conquer them or to build outposts. So, I don't know what I would just hit because I wasn't paying attention. Oh, and this is our kind of navigation map. This will take us to here. This will take us to our, uh, internal... This is our spy network. When we meet other empires, we can see, like, how we rate to them for what we know... Uh, here we'd be able to assign espionage if we want to spy, which we won't do a lot of early on. Here's our tech shit. We can research biotech, energy, propulsion, computers, constructions, weapons, and um, we're, we're just doing that pretty equally. And then you can look at, bloop, 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 what do they all do? If we get really good, oh, well, that's not what I want. The Defiant, we're not going to get that probably, but... Not a medium thing. That ship is badass. Hopefully we don't run into the Borg. Turn! Gothos! Wasn't there a Baron of Gothos from one of the original episodes? You go there, colony ship. And we can see right here it's 22% terraformed if you look in the lower left-hand corner. I was going to point to it with my finger. Science ship. I wish you could rename these. I should go see... I used to have Star Wars Rebellion and you could name your ship. Sadly we can't. But we'll give it a name anyway. You are the USS Penis Prize. Probe deep into space. Okay, you go to Gothos. So we can... It's got a ooh, nice jungle. We can fit a shitload of dumbasses on it. Dumbass jungle. Okay, you start terraforming that. Select planet for terraforming. I'm doing it, computer! Stop telling me what to do, computer mom. And, um... We're going to save some money. This is how much money we're making a turn. Because when we meet a minor race, we can bribe them. Oh, oh, oh. You're going to move up there. The reason is, um... I know it's small, but M are M-class planets. And if you're familiar with the Star Trek show, M-class planets are like Earth, where people can live. So that planet doesn't need to be terraformed. We need to terraform the rest of them. Which means we need another colony ship coming up. We haven't found any other people. Hello? Is anybody out there? Hello? 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 Oh, all these awesome kick-ass planets around us. Get the troop transport done. Um, we don't need so much plasma. So we'll do some more research. I should have done that earlier. We'll leave one in intelligence, I guess. Oops. What am I doing? Quit being so stupid, stupid Paul. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Come on, we gotta colonize that. Terraforming completed. 
There's supposed to be like a bunch of minor races and nobody is. So these people are going to colonize this, system will this be little colonized. planet. And let's colonize this. I want to live here in the giant ball. This okay. system will be colonized. Come on, penis prize. Keep searching for new life. You almost done troop transport? One more time. This system is now Federation territory. It sounds so hostile. This system I've is dominated now Federation you, territory. And now this is where the micromanagement comes in. We can build things at each of these two. We can build a starship here once we have en or a Starfleet shipyard here once we have the energy. I'm gonna buy them a mass replicator. Ordered. And that's how you get the further movement, is if you have a starship thing or an outpost somewhere. And we're going to move that there, because we want to build an outpost there. Uh, Cockburger, you move here. Oh, I'm sorry, Penis Prize. Build a couple replicators here, too. Purchase ordered. And I want this colony ship done. Purchase ordered. With my luck, right now we're going to run into some other little guy, now that I spent all our money. Nobody! Holy fuck, that's a big place. Look, there's an unknown ship! That means there's somebody there. Let's hope it's a minor race. Uh-oh, it might not be, because somebody's been terraforming. The yellow there means someone started terraforming. Okay, so where should you go, plant? Uh, you should go finish terraforming that. Let's meet a new race! Klingons! Greetings, Klingon Empire. I am the Understood. friendly penis Torpedo prize. Max. Let me squirt all over you. The enemy is in retreat. I'm a human. We're hostile. Should I be more peaceful? I should probably be more Federation. -like. They've gone to warp. Stand down from battle stations. An alien culture has been discovered. Great. Greetings from the Klingon Empire. Greetings. We are a race of warriors. And if you do not wish us to prove it to you, we advise you to stay out of our way. Wow, so we just ran into one of the more powerful military major empires right away. That's great. Absolutely fucking kick-ass. That's what I was hoping for. So we're going to start building an outpost, an outpost here. Will be constructed. I guess we'll start colonizing this place to continue terraforming. So planet for terraforming. Um, I guess we don't really need to rush the colony ship. I'm not used to playing on a medium board where you run into people as quickly. An alien culture has been. This discovered. is what we want. The Benzite culture values industry and efficiency. They would be welcome members of the Federation. Hey, Benzite dude, you want to get down with Federations? Oh yeah. Hopefully the Kling the Klingons can attack them though, and they might take them over. Hey, dudes. We're going to offer them a bribe. We'd like to propose a new peace treaty. Perhaps this gift will improve our understanding. Do you give hand jobs? Yeah, to ladies, maybe. Maybe ladies, for sure ladies. So let's see, our outpost is going good. We're terraforming. We're building everywhere. Uh, you can bring up your summary. This is good to do. I should do this more often than I do. So you can see if people are starving or not. <laughs> Excellent. No starving yet. I have to fight these guys. I know I should be nice. Yes, sir. Torpedoes locked. But if the, if the Klingons get... The Fuck enemy off. is in retreat. If the Klingons get a foothold right They've next to, to us, we're in trouble. Stand down from battle stations. Diplomatic messages have been received. Hooray, the Benzite offered us a friendship proposal, even though we offered them one too. We will accept. Treaty will be accepted. Oh man. Look. There's a place to live here, and look how awesome the system is. We get our ass kicked because we have no military weapons. You almost done with the outpost? Finish that fucking outpost. Diplomatic messages have been received. And now that we're friends with the Benzites, we can go to economics here on Seoul. We have trade routes. And we put it on there. And it'll make us money each turn. And not only will it make us money, but it'll make them like us more. They want to be our friends more. 
Prepare to die, armed colony ship. I am American, and you must die. <laughs> Uh, we're gonna have to get some more weapons going before it's long. Oh, and we're gonna have to get some database stuff. Even though the Klingons are not very good at intelligence. Uh, let's go to intelligence. Um, doesn't mean that they won't have any. Yeah, we're slowly, slowly weakening it. Charge! Torpedoes locked. Uh, we didn't get through the shields that time. <laughs> we can't even fight a war. colony ship. Stand down from battle stations. Outpost constructed. Diplomatic messages have been received. Oh, sweet. Check that out. So we're going to go up there and try and steal that planet from them. I mean, they're not there. They just started... The Klingon said, be careful in your expansion unless you form colonies you can't defend. I can't defend any of my colonies, friend. Whatever. I'm the Federation. I do what I want. Section 31 or whatever it is. Almost done with their colony ship. Ooh, look, there's a wormhole. I made wormhole sounds for you. That can take you to another part of the galaxy or that can kill you. Alright, a new colony ship. Culture oh, great. Discovered. Greetings from the Romulan Star Empire. While we do not object to occasional diplomacy and commerce, we prefer to mind our own affairs. If you honor this desire, we will remain amicable neighbors. Now we're fucked. Let's, um, let's become... Hey, you want to be friends, Klingons? Oh, shit. Now we're stuck in other people's space. Oh no, the Klingons colonized that before we could get to it. Select planet for terraforming. Those butt monkeys. Man, that system is kick ass too. And now our ship is stuck in the middle of nowhere. Continue to terraform. Select planet for terraforming. Uh-oh, the Romulans and the Cardassians have a non-aggression treatment. Terraforming Doom. completed. Hooray! Go live on Gothos. You this Gothians. This system will be colonized. It's a planet of Goths. They're all like, we love Goth music and dark stuff. I cut myself at night. That's dark. This system is now Federation territory. Terraforming completed. Diplomatic messages have been received. If you contribute... No, I'm not going to give you money, Klingons. Go Treaty fuck off. Be rejected. You don't want to be my friends. Cox. I fucking hate you, man. So we'll colonize here, too? Wait, where's he going? This system will be colonized. Build some more replicators for this new place? Purchase I guess they order. aren't more. They're the first. So we need a destroyer. We need at least one more colony ship. And then we need more um, military stuff because we're really expanding faster than I think I can maintain. Man, we're going to get stuck in here between these guys. We get gang banged. That's not good. We only have one minor race. This system is now Federation territory. Oh, great. Now the Fringe are friends with the Romulus too. Awesome. That's not good for us. Ooh, there's dilithium here. That's good. We'll buy Just more replicators, ordered. new replicators for this place. For what is that, Pacifica? Find me some new friends, penis prize. Ooh. If we look here at the Empire status, we can see how big everybody is. Right now, we're bigger than the other guys. Um, when it comes to system held. Everything else, we're pretty fucking close. Military, we're a little behind. That's not good. <laughs> Okay, get our destroyer done, and... Ooh, there's a planet. Maybe somebody lives there. Ooh, and there's planets up there, too. We're gonna go up there first, because the Romulans will have a harder time getting there. No, don't come into my territory, Klingons, and you see how weak we are. I mean, we're incredibly strong. 
Okay, from now on, I'm gonna play like I'm gonna role play it. We're gonna be the United Federations of Planets. Greetings, I Romulan colony ship. I'm the USS Penis Prize. Would you let us board you? Come back! I want to penetrate you. The enemy is in retreat. Vulcans are s Romulans are sexy. They've gone to warp. Stand down from battle stations. Nope. Lots of empty planets. Oh man, the Klingons are checking out our territory. That's not good. We're almost done with their destroyer. Let's see how our friends the Benzites are doing. They're receptive. You can ask them to be an affiliate, and then they won't be like friends with other people so much. And you can eventually ask them to be members. But right now, let's just give them a gift so they like us a little more. Dude, here's a gift. Go buy some pot with it. Space pot. It makes you happy. Oh, shh. No. Oh. There's a Klingon. I'm sorry. We have to attack Understood. a Klingon that is in our territory this deep. Target locked. Fire at will. The outpost has to defend itself. Direct hit. Oh my god, our outpost post can't destroy a scout? What is this made out of paper mache? <laughs> like they got more than they bargained for. I got this paper. An alien culture has been discovered. <laughs> They're the, the big buttheads. Are disciplined researchers and share our love of knowledge for its own sake. We want these guys. We want guys who like knowledge and research. So let's go see if the giant big head buttheads, the Keldonians. Oh, the Klingons are friends with the Romulus too. Diplomatic too. messages have been received. Um, no, we're not gonna give you any money, Training Romulans. Fuck off. They're like, give us money. I'll give you a punch to your dick. Keldonians, be our friend, like the Benzites. It's a big friendly party in here. I cannot believe we could not destroy the scout. Our outpost could not destroy a scout. How embarrassing. So let's see how our systems are doing. Everybody's fed. Every Things are being built places. We do need to get the new colony ship out. Yeah. Purchase ordered. Get another destroyer going. Ten! An alien culture has been discovered. It's the ugly the faces. Kelnots are a brutal race and should be approached with caution and respect. Oh, what I should have pointed out earlier, this line here is how much they like or don't like you. The lighter it is to the right, the better. The darker it is, the more they don't like you. These guys don't like us. They're cosmic dickweeds. Actually, let's move that. Let's, uh... Let's get our colony ship fixing up some of these places. Terraforming. The more plants you terraform, like right now, only this one's terraformed. So only 80 people can live here. When we terraform these others, more people can live on the other planets. Pretty, pretty, pretty self-explanatory. So, um, did the Keldonians become our friend? I, would, I didn't remember what I did. Events. Oh, I offered them a friendship proposal. Why can't we be friends? Diplomatic messages Yay. have been received. What the hell? They became our friend and they quit being our friend? What the hell is that bullshit, man? Oh, they became affiliated with the Romulans? You cocksuckers. They took our money and were like, we'll be your friends. And they're like, no, we're the Romulans' friends. You space cocksuckers. So we'll start terraforming one of the planets down Select here. Select planet for terraforming. We'll take a turn. An alien culture has been discovered. The Iridians survive by these guys. selling secret information. We must be extremely cautious and circumspect in dealing with them. All these little guys, they'll have each of the minor races will have one special thing they can build that helps. These guys have something that helps with espionage. Klingons declare war against the Benzites. Diplomatic messages have been received. Great. Okay, first of all. See if the Euridians want to be our friends. I'm not expanding to your border. Do you want to be our friends, please? The buttheads up there wouldn't be. Man, and the Klingons attack or uh, declared war on our friends, the um, Benzites. That's not good. Because I don't know if the Benzites can defend against them. 
Come on, an affiliation tre treaty. Then we can pool our military infrastructures and be stronger to form a whole. Diplomatic messages have been received. Ooh, the Benzites want to talk to us. We are under attack. We need your help now more than ever. The Klingons will destroy us if you do not stop them. Join us, Benzites, and then we'll stop them. Come on, Penis Prize. Keep probing the galaxy. One of these buttheads so fucking bad. Our food's good. Ten. Since you guys are attacking our friends, we've got what to our take the war to them. Lock. Our destroyer Enemy can't even destroy a colony ship. A Klingon colony ship. They've gone to warp. Oh. Stand down from battle stations. How embarrassing. Diplomatic messages have been received. Yay, the Benzites decided to become affiliated with us. Oh, come on, Uridians. Be our friends. This is not exactly the glorious start I was hoping for to impress you all. And you'd be like, ooh, I'm so impressed. We're kind of boxed in here. If we can get the Benzites or somebody to join us. What we'll do is when the penis prize is explored here, we'll see if we can send it up the Klingon backside. <laughs> Uh-oh. Klingon destroyer? If they want to go head to head, right let's away. try it. Torpedoes locked. I think we're in trouble because I think their the destroyers are better retreat. than ours. So we're going to strafe. Fly past the enemy. We'll I fire in at close range. Torpedoes locked. Uh oh. Shields are holding. Let's retreat if we can. Understood. We're gonna die. Damn you, Klingons! A task force has been destroyed. Oh great! Now they declared war against messages us. Have been received. Anti-war demonstrations. I didn't start the war. I just shot them a lot. They liked it. So let's see if we can get the Romulans to join us. Hey, you want to go to war with us against the uh, Klingons? Maybe. It means we need to start building these ships and fast. The one nice thing is it will make the Benzites like us more than anybody that hates the Uridians. Or not the Uridians, the Klingons, sorry. Quit being friends with the Romulans, but giant buttheads. I'm saying please stop being their friends. Terraforming completed. Diplomatic messages have been received. See, the Benzites said something to us. We've all suffered from the hypocrisy of Klingon honor. We wish you the best of luck in opposing them. See, they like us now that we're fighting them. Oh, shit. Is that a troop transport? Fuck. We need a military. We'll keep terraforming Select this. planet for terraforming. Oh, the Klingons stole our planet. Diplomatic messages have been received. The citizens are outraged by our inability to properly defend Pacifica. It's not my fault. Isn't that what you want to hear from your leader? <laughs> Wasn't my fault. I tried. Um, we'll build some universities here, I guess. And upgrade our food re replicator thing. Is this is why it's nice to use the summary too. Murder needs more. More murder. Build a data bank and a university and a replicator and a farm. Data banks for spying universities offer research. Come on, science vessel. We need to find more friends. Oh, the Romulans didn't want to fight a war with us. And the Caledonians said nope. How about if I give you some money, Uridians? Then will you be my friend? 
because that's how you can judge a real friend when they take your money. <laughs> you have to buy real friends, at least I do. Okay, there's one destroyer. Let's get up to our outpost. I don't see a lot of other... I can't tell if there's any scan strength there. Give me a second. I'll be right back. Okay, sorry about that. I was running Fraps, and Fraps has the frame counter, and it was right up here so I couldn't see the scan strength. So they could technically have ships here, and I just can't see it because we have no scan strength. So I'm going to put the science vessel actually up here. Diplomatic messages have been received. Oh, Eurydians! Rejected our friendship proposal. We'll make them our friends yet. Just wait and see. Might not be bad, though. Maybe we'll spend our money getting the destroyer going. Hopefully, sooner or later, we can get these Benzites to join us. Diplomatic messages yeah. have been received. See, they offered us a membership proposal. The time has changed to come come the time has changed to come the time has come to change our formal relationship we're ready to join you completely let's be one Ooh, they want to get serious hmm. we believe that we'd more accurately reflect our level of trust it does take trust to get serious if you want it to be healthy Treaty will be accepted so we're gonna have them join the federation and we're going to go find the Eurydians and we're gonna offer them more money to be our friends Terraforming completed. Yay, the Benzites joined us and we had parades and fireworks. I love those. And we finished terraforming and murder. Select planet for terraforming. Look, we've got almost all of them terraformed. And there's two destroyers there. We need more than that to take it. Oh shit, they only got one of their planets terraformed so far. They are not very developed. It's a whole lot of shit. Fuck, they have no defensive stuff. This is not good. I thought they would be more developed than this. Okay, so we're going to have to... No, I don't want a subspace scanner. I'm sorry. I wanted to... Fuck. I want to fuck? I do, but that's beside the point. We're going to build a space yard, shipyard... Purchase ordered. Oh, fuck. What do I build after that? I guess it's an assembly yard. We want to do that so we can fly our ships into Klingon space. With that extra room. Gotta get these destroyers done. Diplomatic messages have been received. Ooh, the Euridians said yes to being our friends, finally. Double bonus. So we can start a trade thing with them which will make us more money now that we have the spaceship thing here we can fly into Klingon space we need um, more ships before we do that though we gotta have at least three destroyers if we get a troop transport we can take Pacifica back I think so we will put that on the list troop transport poop transport <laughs> poop transport oh uh, but you know what everybody I think that'll be the end of this um lesson this episode um i know this isn't for everybody for those of you who did sit through it all thank you and we're going to continue to try and protect us from the aggressive klingons goodbye